Watch it, guys. Today, we're taking a look at the power of AI, which is artificial intelligence. This website has 30 plus AI magic tools, which are real time video editing, and they can literally do quite a lot of tasks for you. Now, we're going to be removing an object or a person from a video, which is quite a difficult task to do. But this website is going to take care of it using AI. And that's what we're going to take a look at. So, we're going to need a video to actually manipulate here and take out a character. So we're going to be using this in painting. Now in paint is a content aware fill. Basically it's going to remove any object from your video in a few brush strokes. Now it works best on some videos more than others. So you just have to be very careful of what type of video you choose. We're going to go for this one here, which I think is quite a, a difficult video to do, but we're going to do it because obviously it's uh, free to use. Now, inside the website of the AI Magic Tools, you can go in here and there's a bunch of other tools in here you can use, over 30 plus tools, but we're interested in, in painting. You can see here, it's going to allow us to do exactly what we want it to do. So we're going to open this up and we need to upload our video to the site. Now, these AI websites and machine learning websites just get better and better. And the tasks that you're asking it to do is pretty difficult. And uh, we're just going to upload this video here. And we're going to try to remove this woman from the video. Now, I already know that it's not going to be perfect because I haven't got the time to sit here and literally make it as best as I can. But I just want to give you an example of the sort of results you can get from a website like this, removing, uh, you know, uh, objects from videos, which is quite a difficult task. So we now have got this uploaded. I'm going to drag it onto the timeline here and it opens the video up as you can see here. So we've got the video loaded in the timeline and all we need to do now is paint out our object which we want to remove. In this case, it's going to be this woman and we're going to remove her from the video. Now it's not going to be easy because obviously she's a moving object and there's other objects around that it has to take into account and uh, use content aware to fill in where this woman would be walking, which is going to be a difficult task to do. So I'm just going to paint in this um, sort of mask here over the object so it covers it. Now you can be as accurate as you like, but I think uh, I, I think you can just go a little bit more uh, rugged with this one and just go a little bit round the uh, object to remove it. If it's a static object, it's going to be easier to remove that from a video than a moving object like this woman walking. So I'm giving it a pretty difficult task to do. Now, I know it's not going to be perfect, but I just want to show you the power of this particular type of AI. And it's a really powerful tool. You can see here, it's starting to analyze uh, the object and it's removed it. And you can see it's filled in uh, this sort of trees in the background, the grass, the edge of the curb and the blocks. There is a bit of a mark there. And you can see a bit of a ghosting going on. Now you can take a bit more time to mark out some of that black mark on the actual pavement, which I'll show you in a second. So this is just a quick, uh, you know, mask that I put over this woman. And you can see it's already removed a lot of that object quite easily. Uh, it is still there, as you can see. It's not perfect, but the power of this is just absolutely mind blowing. It really is. Now, this is a moving object, which makes it very difficult. So it's going frame by frame, and it's basically filling in with content aware around it. Now, I can make edits to this and try to make it better by just highlighting a bit more around the bottom here to take away that black mark here. And you can see once it starts analyzing the extra marks that I've done here, you should see it disappear. And as you can see, it's now removed it. So the more you mess around with it, the better your results will be. Now, remember, this is a moving object. It makes it very difficult to remove. So it's not going to be 100% perfect, uh, you know, in 2023, but give it a few more years. And I think you could just basically remove anything from a video and you probably won't even be able to see it, uh, you know. But look at, say, for instance, a static object, say, like a, a lamppost or a bin or something like that, you could quite easily remove that and you wouldn't even know it was there. But when it's moving, it's a much more tougher task for this particular type of AI to remove that object. And it is doing a pretty good job. Now you can see what I'm doing here 
is I'm going frame by frame and moving along and moving the dark spots away from the floor. Now you can take a lot more time than what I'm doing here and probably get much more better results than what I'm getting. But I'm just showing you the power of AI and how it can do such a difficult task like this in literally seconds. And this is just one AI website that does 30 plus magic uh, tools that it has. It has plenty of other things on here. So I'm gonna quickly download this and call it done, but you can spend more time. It's not gonna be perfect, but I just wanted to get the point across of how good AI websites are and how you can use them to do a lot of difficult tasks. Now, of course, we can use this for, you know, like chat GPT, where you can use it for uh, writing out recipes or articles, or you can have it writing an essay for you or some sort of, uh, you know, resignation letter, or you may want to write some sort of legal document. You can actually use it for the uh, type of tasks like that. You can also use it for other manipulation of images and videos and other things like that, creating nice cool graphics. There's tons of things you can actually do with AI and it's just getting better and better as time goes on. So this website offers quite a few different things like colorizing black and white photos, loads of different things here, blur background, replace backgrounds. You know, you can do quite a few things like add a green screen to a background, quite a lot of stuff using this. The unfortunate side of it is it's not free. Just like a lot of these AI websites, they're popping up all over the internet. And unfortunately, a lot of them are paid. And a lot of people don't talk about the paid side of it. They just show you what they can do. But, you know, at the end of the day, it comes at a cost. You have to pay for it. But this is the sort of end result I got with just a few seconds of messing around with it. There's still a bit of tweaking I could do with that image. And, and that image would be a lot better than what you're seeing right here. But she was removed from that video, albeit you can see some sort of like ghost effect a little bit there. Uh, so it's not 100% perfect, but it does a pretty good job at, um, you know, removing her from the video. Anyway, I think that's going to be about it for this video. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Just want to say a quick shout out to all my YouTube members. I appreciate the support and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye for now.